what we're going to be doing is looking at hydrophobicity in leaves and that's kind of um, demonstrating the lotus effect which is the effect that um, sees water run straight off leaves and this is because the leaves are very hydrophobic um, and we're going to demonstrate this we have two types of leaves here and the objective of this experiment is to figure out which one is the hydrophobic leaf so which leaf doesn't like water and therefore displays the lotus effect so how we do that is, is we take our leaves and the first thing we do is we'll take our two leaves and lay them flat on the desk and it's important to kind of have tissue around because the water is going to go everywhere. Um, and take some deionized water or just tap water out of a tap and very carefully while the leaf is lying flat on the desk pour some water onto the leaves. Okay, now if you pour it onto the first leaf, the cabbage leaf and then we'll pour it onto the lettuce leaf. Okay. What you're going to notice is, is how the water arranges itself once it falls on the leaf. So if you notice, the water, when it falls on the cabbage leaf, it forms these balls or these spheres on the cabbage leaf and kind of rounds up and gathers together. Whereas on the lettuce leaf, it spreads out and it doesn't separate. So on the cabbage leaf, it's separation up into spheres, whereas on the lettuce leaf, it's not. Okay, now if you take your cabbage leaf then and you tilt it, and watch how the water rolls off the leaf and it stays in its spherical form and rolls off the leaf. Okay, if you take the lettuce leaf then and try it similarly, it roll off, but it rolls off in patches and it still remains on the leaf, whereas the cabbage leaf, more of the surface is dry. That's the first part of the experiment. Now, hydrophobic materials are usually self-cleaning, which means dirt comes off them really easily. So a way to demonstrate this would be to take some honey. And if you take some honey and you drop a drop onto the cabbage leaf and then a drop onto the lettuce leaf, bring the two leaves down to the sink. If we take the lettuce leaf and then pour the water, so not too roughly over the leaf, okay? And the main point of this is how long is it taking it and is the honey cleaning off the leaf quickly? If you take a look at the cabbage leaf and thing, you can actually see the honey is running off the cabbage leaf. So this shows that cabbage leaf is demonstrating a self-cleaning effect and the lettuce leaf isn't. So. The aim of this experiment is then for you to determine which one of these do you think is hydrophobic, judging by what you've observed in this experiment.